if it's almost as if I had an out of body experience because what I was seeing in the reflection was what I thought success was. But deep down inside, I had a yearning for something different. And I write in the first, I think the first chapter of my of my book that when I was 17, the one thing that I appreciated most, I had such an incredible deep connection to the universe, to God. And, and, and I spent the rest of my life trying to get back. Like, how do I get that? And that was what this quest was all about. How, how do I, I don't even have to have the same connection. I just want a connection. And I want to have purpose and I want to have peace and tranquility. And I don't want to have to get up and get on a flight at six in the morning and fly to New York City, get, I mean, at 12 midnight, get there at six in the morning, have a, a meeting every hour on the hour and, and finally be done at two in the morning. And because it's so late, my flight's at seven in the morning, I go straight back to JFK and sleep on the bench. What kind of life is that? It's not. And, and that that's what I was tired of. I was tired of going, you know what? I'm doing everything that everyone told me to do to be successful. And you know what? I'm here. And it really sucks. It's not okay. that glamorous. 